Okay, in this video I'm going to show you how to do sub-menu items like I have here at Dan's Courses. You can see here at Dan's Courses I've got all these menu links but I also have sub-menu links here. So under Classes, if you go to Classes you'll see that if you click on this link right here it's a little slow you get a list, a list layout of all my classes. But then of course you can click on these sub-menu items and go straight to one of the classes. So on the test site we've got the services link right here but what if we want people to see that there's green widgets and blue widgets and not just have to click on services to find out about that. So I'll show you how to do some sub-menu links right here. Okay so first of all I'm gonna click on services and this is in the main menu item and I'm gonna change it right away from blog layout to list layout so if you were to click on services you'd get a list and since it's a section we want to show all the sections um, all the categories um, under this section I'm gonna go down to sections and go from section blog layout to section layout and I'll choose the section which is services and hit save and then back at test site here I'll hit refresh and now if I click on services I should get a list instead so that's just like my site now so then now I want to make some sub menu items so what I'll do is I'll hit new for a new menu item and articles and I'm gonna to go to category blog layout and I want a green widgets category blog layout make that capital G and then I choose the category services green widgets green widgets and I want one column okay and here's the key thing if you want it to be a sub menu item you need to tell it the top parent item so the parent item instead of top will be services so the parent item will be services I hit save and now I've got a sub menu item for green widgets under services now let's do the blue one right quick too so articles I hit new and then articles category blog layout choose the category blue widgets give it a title blue widgets pick the parent item which will be services notice there's green widgets underneath now right so I want this to be also a sub menu item one column and I'll hit save so now I've got two sub menu items under services let's go back to the home page here the front end and click on home and you'll see that it's not showing up if I click on services you can see the two sub menu items and you can see the list here but it's not showing up by default if I click back on home you'll see it disappears well that's frustrating so how would I fix that well to fix that so that these show by default what you need to do is actually believe it or not go to your module manager because this module is controlled by this module manager by this main menu module that's in the left position and if I click on main menu the module manager you could see I could change the name of it first of all to the menu right or left menu right and you'll see here that it says always show sub menu items click yes here right and hit save and now go back to your front page and hit refresh and now your sub menu items are showing by default also notice the name has changed from main menu to left menu and that's how you deal with um, creating sub menu items